I'm Dina Betcher here at Mammoth Mountain where soldiers from Pickle Meadows Mountain Warfare Training Center are training for high altitude and cold weather climates. And we're going to catch up with some of those right now. Well, a majority of uh, modern warfare is held in mountainous terrain, so uh, that's kind of the future of modern warfare up in the mountains, uh, in the snow covered terrain. A lot of these guys are probably about three, four days on skis uh, just out here today. So really first times they've ever skied before in their life. Wow. And how has it been going for them? Are they having a lot of fun here? Oh, yeah. It's a blast. I mean, Mammoth is really good to us. Everybody out here is really supportive of the military. You get a lot of hoots and hollers. Hey, go Marines, go Army. So it's a lot of fun. Awesome. Thanks. After this, what is your next move? Where Where is your next assignment? Do you know or can you tell us? Um, I'm gonna actually going to be stationed up at uh, Bridgeport for a while, okay. for the next three years or so. And uh, I'm going to be instructing other guys on how to ski and how to perform mountain warfare. Oh, great. So you're like a pro up here. Not yet. <laughs> I'll get there. Pretty soon, though, yeah. We, uh, we tend to spend a week at a time at Mammoth uh, learning some of the basics. So most of these guys on the hill that you see today are uh, real junior skiers, maybe never have seen snow before in their life. So this is their first taste of skiing. Uh, they go from here, go back and spend uh, 10 to 14 days in the mountains and doing all backcountry stuff. So really learning how to ski in the unimproved terrain. Uh, this is the fun week, <laughs> at least for the instructors. Uh, telegear mostly because uh, it's easy to maintain, it's easy to learn, uh, and uh, above all, it's very lightweight. So Oliver, we just heard all about you. Can you tell us a little bit about why this run is now named after you? Um, I don't know if you guys can see up at the top of uh, Chair 23, it's called Wipeout Shoots. Recently renamed Oliver Shoots. I took kind of a spill down there yesterday. And was it a bad one? Yeah, yeah, it was a bad one. Is this your first time skiing or have you been skiing for a while? I hope that it's your first time with that kind of a fall. No, no, it's kind of embarrassing. I've been skiing for like 15 years. I just, <laughs> I just ate it really hard. Then it was a total fluke. Uh, yeah, I just kind of made a bad mistake, picked a bad turn and tumbled. Okay. Yeah. Have you been coming to Mammoth um, a bunch to train with all these guys? Uh, no, this is my first time at Mammoth. I've skied some of the other Lake Tahoe areas, but um, everybody here at Mammoth has been super nice to us. Sometimes the military carries a little stigma, but everybody here has been really nice, so thank you, Mammoth Mountain. Great. Well, we love having you guys here. Um, so what is next for you after this? Uh, I'm going to go back to my unit. Uh, I'm from Fort Richardson, Alaska, so um, we're going back up to Anchorage, and then we will be deploying to Afghanistan in November of this year. Wow, good for you. Well, safe travels, and thank you. Thank you. These soldiers come up to Mammoth every year to ski and to train, and they love it up here. So the next time you see them on the slopes, say hello. They love meeting new people. From the top of California, I'm Dina Betcher with the Pickle Meadows Soldiers. Good job. Good job. No, that'd be